What's going on there fellow YouTubers? This is Chris from the Mods Anomalies channel. Guys, it's been about a week, I guess, maybe a hair over a week that I've done a video. Uh, you know, just, you know, trying to spend some time with the kids and stuff like that and getting out when we can when the weather is uh, cooperating. Um, I figured I'd do that before they went back to school and they did this week, which gives me more time to actually knock some of these videos out for you guys. So um, I'm really happy to be able to do that. Okay, this latest sol is 722 from Curiosity Rover. And you can see it right here. You can get it. You can just, I clicked on this one here. You can do either one. It doesn't really matter. So it is from the front nav cam. I did, I think I did left, which doesn't matter. Same picture. Uh, some people claim that the right is a whole lot better. And I mean, like they're saying 300%, which I don't see that, but it doesn't matter uh, because they're still obscured. They're still manipulated. They're still trying to hide. So it doesn't really matter. Um, you can, uh, you can just click on the picture. And like I said, I mean, you could just look at this and, you know, uh, but guys, when you look at this this picture, you think, oh, well, it's a good-looking picture. You know, it looks pretty cool, you know. Um, no, because the more you get into this this photo itself, the lies, just they're just so apparent. I mean, it's just insane how much they block out of this picture. Like, you know, you see this right here, and I, I'm going to show you guys right now that I don't believe this rover went past this point. Although you still see him over here. It looks like it turned. It did, did whatever. It went up. This is fake. These wheel mocks here are fake. All of this crap in here is fake. All the way over here. And this is going to... Oh, my God. I'm going to show you in a little bit why I don't believe these are the wheel mocks, first off. And then I'm going to go... Well, we'll go through the back here first. But it doesn't really matter where we go. You know, the, the fact is that they're still lying. So, regardless. Um, but you're going to see... I mean, it looks it looks funny because you got this gravel. Maybe a little light sand here. A bunch of rocks and boulders and whatnot. And then all of a sudden it looks like beach sand. And then we're back to gravel and all kinds of other crap on the other side. Well, <clears throat> excuse me. You're going to see that that's absolutely BS. All of this in here is absolutely BS. These wheel marks are not right. So, okay. So let's jump into the picture. And like I said, I mean, when you jump into this... I'm going to show you this right now. This is just a normal picture. And you can just... I mean, I don't know if you guys can see this already, but what I do is I look for lines. Now, most people will look for 90 degree angles, which I do too. Um, but when you look at these right here, look at this going across. Looks like a line here, line here, one coming down, kind of going across. Almost looks like a, almost like a half round circle. If you kind of look at that real quick, something going up over here. Now, what you're going to see is some crazy stuff in this, guys. I mean, oh my God. Um, you can just see, I mean, let me just zoom into this. This is just a normal picture. I haven't done anything to this picture, this photo here at all. But look at this. Just right here. Of course, it is pixelated, so I get that. But check this out. You can just see the line of crap that they try to really try to block this out. Here, it looks like the wheel mock stops right here. And it looks like a like they just threw like a canvas over the whole thing. And you can see it right here. Look at this. You can literally see where they've actually put... <laughs> this is funny. A line of where they did the manipulation. Uh, oh, my God. But anyway, so what I did was there's many ways to do these, uh, you know, photos and try to enhance them. Uh, it depends on which ones and, you know, whether the moon photos, because I believe that they did use different techniques. This is more, obviously, the new ones are digitalized and the older ones are more analog. Well, the digital, but they're uh, some, a lot of the old ones like film and stuff like that. But um, depending on how you go through it, you can just either use your adjustments. So I, I like for these here, I'll try to use, I'll try different uh, ways to check them out. Um, but check this out right off the bat. Look at this. Now, right in the background here, this was just a, this is just cool. Look at this. If you can picture like the side, if you're looking at a pyramid, look at it the left hand side. Um, you got this straight edge at the bottom, and then it slants up. See it right there? It goes up like this, comes down, goes back down, has the bottom. Now, I'm not saying that's what that what this is. I'm just trying to give you the idea of the shape of this, like the side of it. And then you've got this right here. It looks like it kind of it comes down, goes across, and then kind of goes down and into the back here. Um, but now just take a good look around. All of a sudden you can see these things just laying around, like on the left-hand side here. You can see this almost looks like a tree roots or something like that hanging over. I'm not saying that's what it is, but just look at all of these. The, suddenly you start to see these round, these different shapes, these squares. Um, and here's another thing. Look at this 90-degree angle white piece. See that right there? Okay. Now just look at the lines. Look for lines. Don't look for colors or, or tones you just want to look at lines because check out the lines right here look at comes across comes right over to here it looks like it goes around like this here there's another one right here like at a base to it like it's like like it's like a step up like one two and whatever this is one two supports 
There's something darker sitting right there. Now, that's what I'm getting at. It just it, there's things here that are amazing, and it's just clearly sitting right here in this in front of this rover. Right over here to the right has that weird line, like I told you. But look at this: one separation, two separations, three. Like it's either a design of whatever this is, or it's openings. Chances are they're not openings because of the because they're white. You'd think they'd be black if there was an opening. It was like it goes inside. You know what I'm saying? Um, look at this in the background. It looks like a little like a quarter round piece. And there's one, two, three, four, five. Looks like there's five things that coming out of that or coming off of it or is the way it's designed. Um, over here, check this out. On the left-hand side, it's got these weird other shapes like a round piece at the bottom. Something coming up here. There's like all kinds of crazy things hidden in here. There's some kind of weird square right here. One, two laying on the ground. And you can just see these lines. Look at these lines, how they just really try to take this stuff out. Just by doing this, just by just going up and down here. Um, I think my buddy Will likes to use the term blinds, which is like the smaller versions. You get them like right here. But this is, looks like they just try to pencil it out or just do something to get rid of it. It's just crazy. Um, all right. Now, this is what I wanted to show you guys. This is, of course, this is the light picture, but let's do this. Let me go back to the normal working picture. Um, see how this looks like? It's just flat, just 2D, nothing, no depth. But now watch this when I enhance this. Suddenly now it looks like it has this weird plate, and it's off the ground. See that? Now I'm going to go back to, we're going to lighten this up a little bit and go right to the, but now check this out. See how it could, like, kind of, I don't know if it's shaped like this here, but it goes across, comes over to here, goes straight across, goes in like this, and you can just still see the faint line of it going towards the back. This is a plate of some sort. It's off the ground, and you can see that now. Um, what you're going to see, too, is I'm going to darken this up a little bit. You can see what looks like a pipe here. You can see the opening, and it goes back, like a small cylindrical something or other on top of this. There's another one. You can just see that little round dot. It goes back, and then it goes into this larger piece here on the top of this plate, whatever this is. I'm calling it a plate for lack of a better word. Uh, I don't know what that is either on the right-hand side of this picture here. See this ring? This round ring type thing? Let me see something there. Well, go back to this. I'm kind of curious with this now because I'm sometimes you just see things on the fly and you just go wow um, but check that out right there there's all these weird look at this something comes out straight it's like comes straight out goes down and it keeps down going down here there's all kinds of crazy stuff in this picture guys um, and watch this we'll just keep going on with this now I'm gonna go ahead and hit snapshot to it now suddenly look at all this stuff that's starting to come out of this all this and round things just now don't get me wrong a lot of this on the bottom here where I said it's all been manipulated and obscured you can see what they'd like this things here but they just really went out of their way to just you know take this stuff right out of the picture now check this out, out right here look at this this piece right here goes up and over stops right here goes up and over here now look at this one two and it looks like this smaller ones here like this one two three four five six and it is like almost like a rounded triangle, so to speak, coming out of the front of that with something round on the top of that. Now, when you stop and look at these lines, you go, well, yeah, but I'm going to show you. I'm going to get into it a little bit deeper. And you're going to see, look at this, like that's weird, almost like a square frame type thing. And there's something right there. I, I don't know, guys. I don't even know what to tell you what this stuff is. But check this out, too. Um, again, let's, let's darken this up even more. Okay. Now, you can start to see like the shapes inside here, too. See this? Comes up, got this corner, goes down, up, does the same thing. One, two, three, four. There's some kind of frame of something, or there's a bunch of little things laying in here. Whatever that is, it's laying there. And these, like I said, guys, these tire, well, these not tire marks, but wheel marks, these are completely false. That's all there is to it. I'm going to show you guys something right here. I don't know if you guys will see this. Let me just back out a little bit. This is the reason why I said this is absolute BS. I'm going to show you this right now. Okay right here okay nice 2d area okay look at this tire mark or this wheel mark call it whatever you like this wheel mark goes right over here and it looks like it stops right here kind of goofy how it does that but pay attention to this area right here watch this what does that and why is it going across the actual meal uh, yeah meal wheel mark why would it do that that's just kind of odd how it does it. it almost looks like it has a little shadow going to it but it looks like whatever this is is mechanical parts laying all over the place and you can start to see whatever this is right here. It's like they really try to ghost it out and just take it out, just blanket it or something over it. Um, here's that plate again. Now you can see something else on here. Look at this. Something round. And there's like something inside it. See it? It's like something right there. It goes like this. There's like three pieces to it. One, two, three. 
and it's got this round uh, sleeve around it, if you will. But there's something more here than meets the eye, guys. This is clearly stuff being hidden in this picture. Whatever this thing is, you can see what it looks like. It's this huge. It's whatever this is. It's got multiple parts to it. And see how it's like kind of like circular? Like one, two, three, whatever this junk is right here. And then it goes like this. It keeps going. Then there's more stuff on standing up and goes over. Standing up goes over. Same thing right here. It just keeps doing it. Whatever this thing is, is pretty large. And it's right smack dab in front of this thing. So my guess is that they're not going to ride over this thing. So they're going to just, they're going to fake the, the wheel marks. That's all there is to it. Check out the back again. Again, you've got, now you're starting to see more of these lines come out. And you're starting to see these shapes. Again, with the back piece, this piece here. Okay. Let me do this. Okay, we're going to jump back and keep going. Now check this thing out. You can see this more pronounced, this piece here in the middle, going up towards the, the top. This is more pronounced now. And you can see this right here. These are clearly not just, you know, just stones just laying on the ground. You can see this. Look at this. Whatever this is, check this thing out. It looks like kind of square. It looks like it has a bigger square base to it. There's something right here. And this this piece here goes right into the whatever this is in the, in the bottom. See that? Now, a lot of this they've really taken out, but you can start to see like little shapes and stuff like trying to pop out of there. That's not my biggest thing. My biggest thing, too, is like, now check this other area out in the upper right where I told you it had this here. Look like a quarter round, whatever this is right here. It keeps going. This actually... Watch this. Let's see if we can do this. It actually has almost a three-quarter circle now, and you can actually see where it looks like it has these things branching off of it, going like this here. There's something right here. You can just see these weird shapes that just, they just don't look like they belong. Now check this piece out. Check this out right here. Now it looks like it has something right here is now connected to whatever this was. If you remember correctly, see this? It looked like that weird, like I said, right here, flat, goes up, kind of like an angle, but there's something else on top of that now. See that? And whatever this white thing is, it has one support, two supports, almost like a rooftop. And something going right here. There's a base to it. Guys, I don't know what this stuff is, but it's clearly junk laying all over in front of this uh, rover. That's that's the best way to explain it. It's just a huge junkyard sitting right in front of this rover. Um, and this was wild for me because, I mean, oh my God, when you really stop and look at this stuff, you just can't help but to go, yeah, what is this? What is this crap laying on? Oh, look at this. See how that has like this weird square type area? You can see like right there. It's And it's, and clearly you can see corners to whatever this is. So there's something laying there. God knows what it is. Um, there's other stuff here. I mean, they did their best to obscure this stuff. Even this mountain. I don't know if you guys notice this. Way, way, way in the back. Let me see if I can do this. Let me go back to this view here real quick. Check this picture out here. Look at the way these mountains look in the back. There's something they actually use. They just put like a blanket over that to cover whatever's in there. Because when you do this, I'm going to take this, go ahead and go to the black. This is going to make it real light. Now check this out. See how like it looks fake like they just drew over something, but there's something clearly sitting there. And of course, this is way off in the distance. So again, God knows what this stuff is, but it's there. Now, again, here's that plate looking thing in the front. You've got these... I don't know how this could possibly be a, a, a wheel mark if this stuff is here. Makes no sense. And you can start to see other stuff starting to pop. But the problem with this is because it's so obscured and, and really manipulated that if you keep going with it, you'll really, uh, yeah, you just won't see much of anything. Unless, of course, you just want to concentrate on that one particular area. Um, that's fine. Now, you can see this stuff. I'm just going to back out so you can get an overall view of this. Look at this stuff laying in the background. Look at this right here in the upper right. Looks like this rectangular box type thing and something in there something shiny on it and that whole now almost this thing makes a complete circle now and i showed you in the beginning right here where it was lighter but now when you go to this one here it's completely dark and it's like a full round circle whatever that thing is is, is clearly in the picture and you can see with these things these lines here connected to something else right here there's something that overlays that there's stuff all in here look at this this is that piece I told you about right here. This black like piece right here has one, two. This is too perfect, guys. Come on. This is clearly intelligently made stuff. Now, we don't know what the heck it is, but you can clearly see this stuff just in here that just, you know, it, it to me, it just screams intelligently made. That's all there is to it. And like I said, I mean, look. Oh, my God. 
Heck, we just for the heck of it, why don't we just go ahead and just throw a... Um, well, let's do it this way. Uh, okay, we can do it that way too. I don't know if it'll show much, but let's let's see what happens. Let's do this again. No, well, I can do this. That's fine. All right, let's do this. Mm, yeah, let's go. Let's do this here. Let's just throw a filter over. See what happens. Now I don't know about you guys, but I can see like all kinds of shapes popping out of here now. See that? If you jump into this picture now a little bit more. You can start to see round pieces, stuff going, just all these weird shapes that clearly don't just look like a round boulder laying on the ground. Um, there's things all over this that clearly, to me, are just not intelligent. I mean, they are intelligent. Let me see this right here. Again, that round. So I don't know, guys. I mean, you guys give me your take on it. I mean, they look intelligently made. I mean, again, you can't make out what these things are. But, oh, my God. This stuff here, I mean, look at this. Let's go back to this. Let's brighten this up a bit. Okay. And again, to me, this is just a bunch of trash laying all over the place. Even if I was to go back to this, see how there's absolutely nothing here to see. Nothing. It's completely been gone. It's completely been taken out. Um, and even just leaving the picture normal, you can see this stuff. But I want to get into the raw photo and show you guys just really what's in here. Um, and just like I said, look at these, just the shapes. These are not, like I said, just a round boulder laying on the ground. There's clearly things in it. Just, I mean, I don't know what this is even here. This elongated whatever this is and it has this piece coming down. I don't know if there's something just, it looks like it's hanging down from it. But let's do this. Let's go back. All right. So anyway, guys, just want to do a quick and for you guys. I didn't want to make it too long. Um, but like I said, I am back. I'm going to be making more and more videos because um, I got a little bit more freer time when I can and I'm going to try to knock some more of these out because there's a whole bunch I've been trying to do and trying to get out I just noticed this here I don't know if you guys seen this yourselves look at this one two three four there's like these four squares or shapes I don't know what they are but they're one two three four in a row there's one two and then you've got that kind of piece here see that one two three there's like four or five pieces there, and then there's two bigger ones here and then that, like I said that piece, piece there but what's crazy about it is when you look at these Look at this, like there's something else arched right there. One, two, looks like a round circle there, and it looks like almost a third. It's just like these bunch of stuff just thrown away that's been thrashed and just thrown in places. They're just, just thrown anywhere. I mean, it's nothing looks organized, unless it's something we're just not, you know, uh, our brains cannot comprehend what this stuff could be, meaning, you know, it could be totally something totally different how they make their structures, uh, you know, mechanical parts, vehicles, call them what you will. I don't care what you call them, to be honest with you. But, again, look at this. Like, it has this weird hook thing right here coming off that. Look, I was just saying about that elongated piece. See that right there? It's like this, looks like there's something in there. Like, this is a shadowed area. Like, the, like it goes inside. I, I don't know. But whatever this stuff is, it looks like it's been thrashed. Looks like it's just been thrown in every direction. Some stuff looks like it's standing normal. Like, like there's one, two. Like, this is some kind of structure type thing. Like the rooftop of that thing or whatever. I, I don't know. Look at this. This thing on the side, it actually, it's pretty tall. See this rectangular area and this dock area? It looks like it has one, two, three little... See, it kind of has these, it looks like openings to it or something. And it comes down in the front right here. It has like kind of a uh, grayish area in the front. I don't know. I mean, you can just look at the details in this thing and it's just crazy. But, um, yeah, I wanted to... Man... I just wanted to do this for you guys because I thought this was amazing. And you don't see too much of this lately in these latest solves, especially with Curiosity, because they're doing everything they can to obscure this stuff. And you can clearly, to me, this looks like a junkyard of stuff laying around. This doesn't look like your average, you know, boulder field. Um, I don't know if you guys noticed this too. Like this one, two, three, four. Like it kind of does this arch thing too. See that kind of? And maybe just the way this stuff's laying there, and it kind of looks like this elongated arch, kind of like this one here, this piece here that's arched. It's I said there's one, two, three, four, five. Looks like small squares, and then these two bigger ones. I don't know, guys. You guys tell me what you think this stuff is. I mean, I'm just seeing a junkyard full of trash sitting right in front of this uh, rover, and they're doing what they can to, to block it out because, like I said, I'm going to do this. Watch this. Let me back out and take a look at that, and you can just see this stuff laying all over the place, including right here in front of the rover. Like I said, right here. I don't think this rover went any further than right here. 
and all of this is garbage because you can clearly see where they just really went to town and just yeah try to do uh, obscure the heck out of this thing and really manipulate it so you can see this stuff um, it's clearly you know all laying in front of this this rover and they're trying to make it look like oh yeah just we figure we'll just stop and do a rock sample really yeah okay yeah if you believe that I'll tell you about the swamp land I got in Florida but check this stuff out look at this I mean just the weird shapes things just laying about I don't know guys you guys give me your take on it because I'd be really curious to me like I said it just looks like a giant giant field full of crap that's just been exploded and just tossed around here nothing and you can just and I did it this way and you can still see all of these pieces now when you back out and look at there's nothing there it kind of looks 2d completely flat yeah nothing there maybe a few shapes couple lines you don't think nothing of it until you like I said you really get into this picture and then you just wow you know you can't help but to just go wow that's just that's insane but give me your take on it guys let me know what you think I'm going to hop on out of here. I just figured I'd just do that one real quick for you guys. Um, and like I said, I'll be doing more of these because, like I said, I'm getting a little bit more time now. I was trying to do my best to spend some time with the kids before they got into school. So, yeah, but now that they are in school, it frees up some time for me. So, you know, it's a, it's a beautiful thing. Anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think. Um, uh, thanks to everybody who's jumped on board lately. I do appreciate it. We're going to do what we can to really rock and roll this uh, pretty soon there. Um, you know, we've got some upcoming... Uh, videos. I had some people sending me some wild stuff. Wow. Um, in fact, I'm uh, busy talking to somebody right now that heck just showed me a picture that was just like phenomenal. Uh, it just totally blew me out of my socks. But, you know, like I said, we're going to try to bring you some more crazy stuff, whether it be the moon, uh, Mars, uh, anything we can just dig up. We're just going to just, just have at it. Simple as that. Anyway, guys, again, thanks for jumping on board. I do appreciate it. Always appreciate you guys' comments and you guys watching. Uh, this is the reason why I'm doing the videos, guys. It's what it's all about. So we're going to be back in the full swing. And, uh, yeah, we're going to bring you some uh, good stuff. Anyway, guys, again, thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. And I'll talk to you guys soon.